so so got back last night from Ireland at about a quarter to one in the morning um, searched for the keys that I couldn't find and found them went to sleep woke up this morning seven checked to see if the funds had come through off my virtual crypto sale no the bank account is still not verified went over to the house I was expecting a package at some stage today waited around for furniture guys to come as soon as they arrived I headed over to Ikea uh, Curry's bought a TV Ikea bought all the bedding some bathroom mats all of the above some bins some door mats went back to the house dropped that off um, the furniture guys left the package arrived and then I was putting together the TV and the cleaners arrived I left them too for about an hour and a half went back over finished putting the TV together set up the broadband and the new TV thing missing a cable or two off of the connection but we'll check that in the morning um, I've got people checking in at 10 o'clock need to sort out some shampoos some soaps perhaps um, need to go over and try the wash machine first thing in the morning then try the dryer then I put on the dishwasher before I left um, and get some toilet rolls a few bits and pieces and that's it these people arrive at 10 o'clock need to change the lock on the front door because there's only one key so I'm going to tell them about that and I have to tell them about the um, tile seat missing I have to pay the cleaners I have to borrow another thousand quid off another friend today because that money didn't come through um, and I need to ring booking.com so after 10 o'clock once these people are checked in then I need to spend the day um, on the phone to booking.com to figure out about when I'm going to get make any money out of this and the insurance woman I rang her today and she ignored my call literally wouldn't take the phone call so I need to get insured tomorrow as well and I don't have any money to pay for that either um, really up against it is um, both my credit card is still maxed out my bank draft was obviously a thousand quid off of that today so that's back up now to I've got about 150 quid left to spend on it by the time I pay the cleaner that's going to be down to zero I'd say so um, I need to get borrowing more and more I am more than a little sunburnt my nose is on fire um, it's going to be difficult these people are here for four nights and then they leave and there's a break of about three or four nights before anyone else comes in the one booking that I had for three weeks it was cancelled on Monday so that's a bit of a nightmare um, but whatever you can't be banking this money spending this money before you bank it um, we will see just wanted to make a little thing because I haven't made any videos all weekend and it'll be some kind of a record but busy day today tough day after the weekend that I've had but I'm up against it for money anyway put that on photo by accident uh, it's now just about ten o'clock on the button uh, I'm just waiting for the first guest to arrive uh, he did ring about an hour ago to say he'd be here in half an hour um, I've been over here since half seven fit some safety chai locks on the doors set up the TV the broadband is all connected now um, so they should be good to go more or less there is a uh, still the lady with the insurance has still not come back to me it's been ongoing for over three weeks now it's ridiculous even though I sent her in everything like over two weeks ago and chased her about five times she didn't even call me back yesterday that's my biggest concern at the moment um, but other than that we're more or less good to go I hope they're here for four days and then I've got three or four days to iron out some other little bits so we shall see how it goes.